You know what? We're going back this way. I'll find him myself. I found your ex. There she is. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a great day. As we're getting started here, I just wanted to give a quick reminder for you guys to please like this video. Make sure you leave me a comment and definitely subscribe if you want to see more. But either way, I hope you guys enjoy watching me play Red Dead Redemption for the first time. Got that one. Yeah. All right, buddy. You just gotta you gotta go pick him up. It's just horses. I don't want to skin a horse. Let me uh, see if I can get this body though. He's got six bucks on him. Anything in the wagon? Nope. Come on. I don't mind skinning most animals, but I don't care for skinning the horses. There's a bird up there that just seems to be stuck in the sky. So I still need a couple more deer and a couple coyote. I think it still let me keep my survivalist even though I died. There's some coyotes. was coming and I run off. I think there's another one out there, isn't there? Thank 
Oh. Sorry, sorry, lady. I was aiming for the coyote. <laughs> she didn't make it, guys. I ain't getting fresh. He just jumped right in the way of my bullet. What was I supposed to do? Last still. <laughs> you shouldn't be running around here out like that anyway. All right, let's get back out to the road, though. I get these last couple coyotes, I think. I don't know if that was damage or not. Ah, uh, just lost it. Oh, son of a gun, where'd you come from? <laughs> Dang it, I was so close to getting that one. All I had to do was skin those. Sure, actually. Here. Yeah. Yeah. Deer and coyotes. Yeah, we're still good there. What are you doing over here? Don't think you'll be wanting this no more, friend. Let's go back up this hill again. Feel like we've been here before. Time or two. We're just running into all kinds of trouble on the road today. I don't think we're ever going to make it to Marshall Johnson. Mercer. 
Is it time to go see Bill? Marshall, where are you? Where's it, where, where's it telling me to go? You know what? We're going back this way. I'll find him myself. I found your ex. There she is. Hey, boys. John. Sir. Marshal. Gentlemen. No. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> what a ragtag group of group of guys. It's time. We must go. Why? What's happening? Seth has managed to get himself inside. <laughs> but we can't leave it too long, or they will soon realize how very curious he is and remove him from the premises. Or slit his throat and watch him bleed to death. Mm -hmm. But for a minute, he will delight and amuse them. <laughs> That's when he'll get us inside. Okay. Marshals of the law, when the shooting starts, take that as your cue to start awarding each other medals. Hmm? I mean, take that as a cue to get inside and clean up the mess. Oh. All I care about is Williamson. It is vital we stop him. Agreed. That man is a stone-cold killer. Williamson's a proud fool. The question is which will win out between his pride and his instinct for survival. Instinct for survival always wins out. When it comes down to it, you do whatever you have to do to stay alive. Escunce yourself in the back of my wagon, John, so that we can make our grand entrance. Here we go. <laughs> you don't want to be standing on that side of things. Come on. Let's go. All right, good. Now just stay put till I tell you otherwise. That scoundrel Seth had better not let us down. Once we're inside and I've lulled our adversaries into a false sense of security with some beguiling sales pattern, I will give you the signal. What signal? The moment you hear a sharp rap on the side of the wagon, rise like the phoenix and start shooting like you've never shot before. This is it, my dear boy. Here we go. Oh, Me and you, John. One last time into the breach. This is going to have to be the performance of my life. I hope my nerves don't get the better of me. Me too. I'll be honest with you, John. I'm a little jittery. John? Stop talking John? to me. You look stupid. There's of miracles back here. Thank God. I'll be ready with that machine gun, my dear boy. I'll be a sitting duck in there. Hi, Seth. My good men, <laughs> what would you say if I said immortality was at hand? What would you say if I told you I could teach you to fly? <laughs> what would you say if I told you I could turn a man into a beautiful woman? <laughs> Impossible, yes, once, but no more. Gentlemen, I bring you wisdom from the East. I have here in this wagon some of the finest goods, the best medicines, and the newest inventions available for you and your families. 
exotic trinkets from the far reaches of the earth, elixirs that give vigor and strength. <laughs> and uh, for you men of physical skill and athletic physique, uh, this miraculous elixir can keep the muscles supple and relax the cords. I'm getting and nervous. the joints and gives a feeling of vigor and freshness to the whole system. Why, some men have reported to me that after drinking it for one month, they can chew through steel. <laughs> what the f***? It's a trap! Yeah! like no this is a uh, hard to control Can you use the dead eye with this? You can't. You can't use dead eye with this. I just wasted that moonshine. <sighs> hmm. Wonder if this, thing's still this thing is so hard to control. Where's these guys at? I don't understand why I can't use dead eye here. Listen. Finally. Dang pig, they're so 
break the other side of the fort. All right, let's go. I hate Jonah. Why did it lock onto him? He's not the one I want to kill. I want to kill Jonah. Come on, let's go. That was, that was, that was crazy. Like why it just automatically locked onto Eli, I don't know. Where are they? Go down. Alright. Hang on. I'm here, Marshall. That's the last of them. Nice. We still can't find Williamson anywhere. Hey! It's the snake oil guy! General Adam let me in, for goodness sake! That fool must be hiding. Man, it is time to start tearing this place apart and find out where he's cowering. You got sense of urgency here, please? Is he out, the out there? It's the snake wall guy. Oh Get the, the f gate open and lock it behind him. Bill's got him, don't he? Oh, we've got company, gentlemen. These scoundrels have got reinforcements riding this way. Oh That's where Bill is. There must be a hundred of them. Oh, boy. John, what are you doing? Well, that's like six, not a hundred, but okay. Ugh. Do they have a machine gun too? Son of a gun. This machine gun's terrible.
Yeah, you guys no did it. Here. We looked everywhere. Oh, hold on! Oh, hold on, I Marcy, missed it. Mr. Marston, we got a live one. He says, Bill's already run off to Mexico yesterday morning. Hmm. You'll never get him. Javier Escuela. Javier? He's going to see Javier Escuela. Who's that? That should make things interesting. Where in Mexico? How should I know? Oh! Ooh. Where in Mexico, you little... <laughs> Some place near Chuparos, I think he said. <laughs> Kill him. Bandit country. This whole place is bandit country. Chuparosa. Oh, well, I'll take you there, John. Uh, I'm real popular down there. I bet. Just meet me at the ferry. I've got lots of friends down south. I'll see you at the ferry, <laughs> Irish. And just get me things. I'm sorry about this, John. I guess you'll be heading to Mexico. So Been insane. waiting for that. How is it down there? Wonderful. A sweet, peace-loving people with a love of social justice. May you always find coin in your pocket. It's been a pleasure spending time with you, boy. You too, Mr. West Dickens. Marshall? All right, boys. That's enough. See you, Seth. I thought he was saying that guy's name was Javier, like he knew him for some reason. Because he, he was like, Javier Escuela, like he just acted like he knew that guy, or recognized him, but I guess not. All right, I guess it's uh, off to Mexico. But before we do that, we're gonna take a quick break here and save Mexico for the next episode, I think. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, thanks so much for hanging around. I appreciate it. You guys are the absolute best. If you enjoyed it, leave a like on the video, subscribe if you're new. Either way, I will see you guys in Mexico in the next episode. Bye. Bye.